Hello and welcome aboard the newly redesigned Hurricane Sun Deck Sport 188 OB. This is one of the best selling deck boats of all time because of its versatility and its value. Let's take a look. We are on the uh, forward boarding deck of the uh, 188 outboard. As you can see, uh, that deck is going to run the full beam of this boat. Of course, that's a uh, signature of the uh, Hurricane deck boat line, bringing that beam all the way forward. Eight foot, six inch beam, extremely wide boat. But having this integrated uh, platform up here, uh, as you can see, makes it very, very easy to move around that non-skid uh, surface. Uh, we've got a uh, nicely designed anchor lock here, here and a couple of great features here. Not only is it uh, uh, wider than a lot of boats this size, uh, but you're also going to have the uh, molded in uh, chafe guard here. Going to keep that, uh, that uh, anchor line from uh, fraying. Also, we've got a, uh, an anchor line guide here. It's really going to hold you in place on uh, windy days like we have today. Moving over to the starboard side, just like all uh, hurricane deck boats, you can access the bow from the water with this cleverly designed recessed boarding ladder. That's going to recess, telescope right in, slide it into the deck, and it's going to close flat so you're going to be able to walk around this deck very easily without uh, tripping over it. This particular uh, 188 is configured with a fishing package, and we'll point out a couple of those features as we move around the boat. Uh, but uh, especially uh, nice to have up on this uh, forward deck is this uh, deluxe fishing pedestal chair. Um, swivels all around, of course, completely around. Fight fish on uh, all over the boat here. And as we can see, you can fold this down and then it'll lock into position. So if you're going to uh, move from one side of the lake to the other, if you're going to uh, leave this seat up here when you're uh, transporting the boat, trailering it, um, uh, it's going to be very, very safe. And then, of course, when you get to your uh, fishing hole, simply flip that back up. Very comfortable seat. Stepping down into the uh, forward uh, seating area here, you see there's a, a nice molded uh, easy step uh, down in, uh, multi-step. It's going to be covered with that, uh, that non-skid surface. Cup holders up here. Beautiful uh, stainless steel grab handles as you can see. And I'm going to walk down here and point out yet another uh, fishing feature for the uh, deluxe fishing package. Uh, you can see that this has got this nice uh, surface on here as well, very easy to take care of. But you can open this up and that reveals a, uh, an aerated uh, bait well or live well. Uh, simply keep your bait fish in there uh, or your, uh, your catch and you've got a pump that's operated by a switch on the helm and that's going to keep those uh, fish fresh for much longer. Beautiful sand snapping carpet. This is an upgrade on this boat, a, uh, an option. Uh, you can see that um, the carpet is actually uh, cut into pieces, uh, sections I should say. And what that's going to do is allow you to take individual areas uh, of the carpeting out of the boat to clean it for any reason. Or if you just want to pull all the pieces out and uh, wash the entire uh, deck down. Um, that's really, really handy. Um, anytime you want to clean the boat, there's uh, scuffers on the back of the uh, cockpit here and that's gonna drain directly overboard. So really, really nice feature to uh, help keep the boat clean. We've got some uh, interior LED lights here. That's gonna illuminate the uh, forward seating area as you're uh, underway in the evening. Two forward facing lounges on either side here. Uh, nice uh, uh, wrap around lounges. You can see uh, the beautiful attention to detail. New for this year, we've got this raised headrest. Uh, beautiful with that uh, uh, sky blue option. Uh, we'll take a look at the uh, when the boat's running. You'll be able to see this uh, beautiful gel coat on on this uh, color choice. But uh, nice uh, upgraded upholstery design choices here as well. Really beautiful. Expanded soft touch vinyl. Extremely easy to take care of. It's going to last a long time. Beautiful piping and these uh, seat bolsters here. Not only is that a nice design feature, but that just makes it so much more comfortable to sit. Uh, when you're out on the boat or boat all day, um, you want to want to extend your boating day just uh, to every little bit that you can add uh, for your comfort. Uh, it's just going to make you stay out there a little bit longer and enjoy the boat all that much more. We've also got some really deep, dedicated storage down here. That's uh, self-draining. 
uh, plenty of room, very deep, and uh, uh, runs a, a good bit right up into the bow there. Uh, as you can see, just very easy to access. Just slide the cushion out of the way and get the gear you need, whether it's towels, um, uh, refreshments, uh, life jackets, whatever you've got. Stepping to the midship area of the boat, this is a new design. Um, there are a couple of different options that this uh, area can come configured with, including a uh, manual pressure uh, freshwater sink. Right now it's set up as a uh, self-draining cooler, and you can imagine how convenient this is for uh, both the forward and the aft uh, seating areas. Uh, we got this packed with uh, ice and drinks, just very easy to get to, and of course that's just going to drain over the side. Recessed cup holders here, plenty of extra storage, and uh, here's the first clue of the uh, terrific uh, stereo system on this boat. We'll look at it in just a second, it's under the helm. Um, but uh, uh, really, really nice. We got speakers uh, all around this boat, so you're really going to have uh, great access to tunes while you're uh, on the water. We've also got this oversized in floor locker. As you can see, that lifts up here very easily. That's a hydraulic assist. Um, extremely deep, uh, really cavernous uh, storage down here. All of those uh, bulky life jackets, your um, uh, safety kits. Uh, water sports gear, that's all going to go right in here. It's not going to be underfoot while you're out on the water. Take a look at the uh, integrated uh, tower here that we've got on the 188. You can see every, all the lines flow beautifully with the, uh, with the rest of the boat. Uh, just a really, really sharp uh, look. We've also got a, uh, an integrated bimini here. This is a uh, new for uh, 2014, the, uh, uh, the tower top, I think is what we're calling it and uh, just provides that great amount of shade. Uh, perfect size for this boat, help you get out of the uh, sun. Um, uh, really sleek looking too. Um, just really fits well with this uh, boat design. You've got plenty of room for all your entertaining back here in the, uh, in the cockpit lounge. Nice uh, L-shaped lounge there. Uh, rear facing backrest, again with that uh, uh, new uh, upholstered uh, headrest again this year. Uh, and those uh, sky blue uh, upholstery accents. Uh, but just look how clean this is. Uh, it's a beautiful design. Uh, stainless steel grab handle here. Uh, new design for the uh, cockpit pedestal table this year. Previously we had the uh, receiver uh, built into the floor, into the deck, um, just like we did on the uh, fishing chair up front. Uh, and that was fine, you know, it's, it's fine to move around back here, but the uh, engineers at Hurricane came up with this really clever way of putting a bracket uh, directly into the side of the, uh, the fiberglass uh, helm seat, uh, the fiberglass um, base here. So what that's going to do is just allow you to uh, come out at an angle, have the uh, uh, cockpit table at approximately the same position it's always been, but give you that uh, little better uh, traffic flow through here. Um, the, uh, the molded cocktail table top here, as you can see, we have recessed cup holders, and areas for plates or just if you wanted to serve snacks uh, directly on here, very easy to clean, take care of. And of course this entire thing can be stored. Uh, this slides uh, completely out. So you can stow this if for whatever reason you didn't need it. But it really is handy when you've got extra folks on board, particularly kids, serve them their lunch right here. Lots more storage under these seats back here. Again, uh, one of the great things about uh, Hurricane is that uh, they really maximize the amount of storage on every single available uh, area that you could possibly think of. Uh, if there's an extra bit of room, they make storage out of it. So plenty of storage under here, That again, that nicely finished uh, tub. Simply lift that cushion right up and through the corner. And uh, a really neat idea they've had is to um, create a, a cavity under one of the uh, lounge seats back here, one of the benches, and that's going to allow you to slide a, uh, a cooler uh, directly in there. It's going to slide and get it out of the way so it's not going to be popped up, but uh, it's also got this ridge around the front so it's not going to slide out or move around when you're, uh, when you're underway. Really, really handy. Also from this point of view, you can also see the, uh, the ski toe eye, this pylon here that we've got. Um, that's a great uh, uh, place to tie off for uh, uh, water ski handles or uh, for uh, tubing as well. That's going to clear your tow rope 
way over your the top of your uh, outboard engine back there and give you a nice uh, field of view to uh, to operate the uh, the tow uh, while the uh, riders while you're underway. You can see by the uh, uh, windscreen here that we've got it over the uh, helm station that this is the Sundeck Sport model. Uh, the Sundeck has a full wraparound windshield, but uh, uh, for um, uh, these particular boats, it really, really cleans up the uh, design, um, gives you a nice little bit of protection here for your instrument cluster, uh, but uh, doesn't have the, uh, the full windshield. Um, sometimes you just don't need that. Uh, taking a look at the dashboard here, you see these oversized high contrast gauges. Um, very, very easy to read as you can see even when we're out here in the, uh, in the sunlight. Uh, this boat is configured with an, uh, an aftermarket option uh, on the Hurricane Sundeck uh, 188, um, Sundeck Sport 188. That's uh, the uh, Garmin Echo Map Chart Plotter. Uh, we had the opportunity to, uh, to work with this uh, device a good bit yesterday and uh, really, really uh, picks up your location quickly, uh, extremely intuitive, very easy to use, so you won't lose your way when you're out cruising around. We've also got a couple of uh, uh, convenient cup holders here. Of course, the captain's got to have one as well. Um, nice big uh, oversized toggle switches and labels. Uh, sometimes uh, you'll see labels that are so small it's very hard to read. These, you know exactly what they are. We've got a uh, really convenient soft touch steering wheel here. A molded footrest for the uh, driver and um, uh, new for uh, 2014. There's also a, uh, a Bluetooth enabled uh, Sony stereo system. Uh, that's a, uh, an option again on this boat, but uh, would, if you've ever been out on the water and had to uh, worry about whether you have the exact right cords to, uh, to plug in, of course you've got the wires dangling everywhere. This is so easy if you want to play your music like most people do from their iPod or their uh, iPhone or Android. Uh, just simply uh, pair your device up with the uh, stereo system there and you can play your music all day. In fact, multiple people can do that. A uh, convenient throttle position here. Of course, the, uh, the, the top of the uh, gunnel here is a convenient place for that armrest while you're underway uh, if you're not operating the throttle. We've also got a, uh, another uh, speaker here. Again, this, uh, this boat uh, really has a, a, a nicely thought out uh, sound system. The captain's chair is uh, very nicely done. Again, that uh, a soft touch expanded vinyl. And note the, uh, the back here is uh, somewhat open, and left it open to provide ventilation for the driver. When you're out on the water all day in the summertime, sometimes that just extra little bit of uh, ventilation will help you uh, stay comfortable all day long. Let's take a look at the uh, rear deck of the uh, 188 outboard. Uh, got a convenient step up here, again that uh, non-skid surface, that diamond pattern, uh, even when it's wet, it's going to provide you some nice traction back here. Uh, on either side of the outboard, that's going to be continued here. We've got a uh, fresh water wash down uh, that's right by the uh, swim ladder. And of course, that's going to be so convenient when you uh, pull yourself up out of the uh, water with this telescoping boarding ladder, similar to the one we had up, up front there in the bow. Pull yourself up, and if you've got uh, muddy feet, or sandy feet, just want to wa wash down the, uh, wash off the uh, lake water. Uh, simply slide that back in. It's going to completely wash down. You can wash down the whole deck back here, uh, and that tucks safely away until the next time you need it. We've got a uh, Yamaha 115 horsepower outboard on this boat. This boat's actually rated for up to 200 horsepower. Uh, but note the uh, oversized splash well here. Uh, when you're out, particularly on uh, rougher days, you might take a little bit of water over the, uh, over the transom there. And two big drains are really going to help make sure that you evacuate that water as quickly as possible. Over on the port side, we've got a, uh, a really convenient uh, self-draining cooler or storage. If you want to put dock lines back here, you can certainly do that. Uh, but if you're going to be hanging out uh, on the uh, back of the boat, uh, watching the kids swim, whatever you're going to be doing back here uh, while you're uh, drifting or at anchor or, or beach. Uh, always nice to, uh, to have the uh, cooler so handy. You don't have to climb all the way back in the boat. You can really reach it from the water. Notice these nice touches as well with the uh, uh, stainless hardware uh, as we've been seeing all around the boat. Just wanted to point that out. That's really a, a really beautiful design feature.
Well, I really hope you enjoyed this look at the uh, newly updated for 2014 Hurricane Sundeck Sport 188 outboard. Some really nice upgrades. We saw that uh, fishing package, uh, beautiful uh, designs on the upholstery, lots of storage, perfect, versatile boat on the water. Till next time, this is Captain Steve.